One of the most common questions that I get asked is how to fix items to drywall or stud partition walls. It is actually very easy and all you need is a set of magnets like that. These can help tremendously when you are fixing to a drywall or a stud partition wall. You can of course use plasterboard fixings but plasterboard fixings are nowhere near as strong as the actual stud which is holding up the plasterboard. Obviously if you're installing something such as a TV which would be seriously damaged if it was to fall from the wall you do need to ensure that it is fixed correctly. So this is a stud wall and as you can see it is actually wallpapered. So to start off with we need to find out where the actual studs are. So to do that I'm going to use a small medium magnet like that. And all we need to do is rub that over the wall until the magnet picks something up. It can take a while before you actually find the first one. And what we're actually looking for is the screw head, which is holding the plasterboard to the studs. And I've actually found one just there. So I'll now just try and find another screw there's one there. So obviously there is a stud running down there where the two magnets are. I'll now move this way, see if we can find the next stud. I'll now go this way. So you can now see the three rows of magnets and that is where the studs are in this wall. So if you were to fix something very heavy to that wall such as a TV, you would definitely want to fix it there where the studs are. If you do that you can simply use a long screw, maybe two or three inches long. That will screw straight through the bracket that you're using and straight into the wooden stud behind. So what you can do now is you can draw a faint line on there you can then take your bracket and you can fix that on the wall and with this one you can actually just about get all three studs. If you can't get three you can at least get two of them. So you could use that stud there and that stud there and that will give you your fixing holes to ensure that the bracket is firmly fixed to the wall. These are the quartz screws that have been supplied with the bracket and it is essential that you use these. Obviously you can't just go drilling that straight into the stud. You do need to drill a pilot hole first. Before you do that you need to find the exact centre of the stud. So we've now identified where the screw heads are but we now need to find the centre of the stud. That can be done using something like this. This is a small hex key, sometimes called an allen key. That is the smallest size that I actually have and that is quite rigid and will only leave a small hole. If you don't have one of these you could use a brad awl. A brad awl is the ideal tool for doing this. So this is the part where the stud is but we now need to locate the exact centre of the stud. So to do that I'm going to use this. I'm going to get it and I'm going to push it into the drywall or the plasterboard and you'll notice that that is solid there. So that is where the stud is. So I'm just going to come to the side a little bit. It's still solid there. So the stud is still there. I'll then move about another six mil away. This time that has gone all the way through. So I'm now going to move in the other direction. Solid there. Solid again. Solid again, still solid, and again it's gone straight through. By doing that, we obviously know that the stud is positioned there. 
So that enables you to use a screw and you can actually screw in the dead centre of that and then you are confident that you are in the centre of the stud. If you go to the side of the stud, obviously the screw will not take as much weight and there is a chance that the screw could pull out of the timber. I hope you've enjoyed watching this video. If you have and you haven't done so already, please subscribe to the channel.